not a game, it's a red skin. To replicate this adjustment layer, create a new layer. Fill it with black. Change blending mode to multiply. Reduce the opacity to adjust the darkening effect. You can also use a mask to apply an effect to a specific area. Create a new layer. Fill it with white. Change blending mode to overlay. Reduce the opacity to adjust the effect. You can also use a mask in this situation. Duplicate the layer. Change the blending mode to overlay. Reduce the opacity to adjust the effect. Use a color picker tool with a high average sample rate, pick the area where the image is not too bright and not too dark. Create a new layer. Fill the sampled color on the new layer. Change the blending mode to LCH color. Create a new layer. Fill it with white. Change blending mode to difference. Create a new layer. Fill it with black. Change blending mode to LCH color. If you reduce the opacity, then you can also use this method to desaturate your images. As you can see in this image, the darken effect affects the entire image. To concentrate our effect on the subject, create a layer group. Put the subject layer and the effect layer to the layer group. As you can see, the darken effect has been applied to our subject layer. Now, let's use all those blending layers to make a nice composition. And if you want to know how I made this highlight, then watch our previous video about how to paint light and shadow.